Iran. COVID-19 death toll exceeds 190,300. Over 190,300 people have died of the coronavirus in Iran, according to the MEK on Wednesday. The official death toll occurred by the regime stands at 54,156. President Hassan Rouhani resorted to more lies today as the officials grew more concerned about public protests over their refusal to procure COVID-19 vaccines. He said there should be no concerns about the production of indigenous vaccines and procuring foreign-made vaccines. Alongside the world, and even better than some countries, we have been advancing in the fight against this virus. The central bank and health ministry are doing their best in conducting the necessary planning to provide a trustable foreign vaccine for the people, and we are taking measures to produce indigenous vaccines. In the past seven years, the country's health system has been able to double its abilities and this government health apparatus abilities have been twice that of our country's entire history. Political prisoners transferred to Rajashah prison. Political prisoners Mohammed Amekazi and Payam Shakabar were transferred from Evan prison in Tehran to Rajashah prison in Karaj on Saturday. The two prisoners were abruptly moved from the political prisoners ward in Rajeshah prison to the Intelligence Ministry Ward 209 in Evin prison in July, along with political prisoner Majid Asadi. All three prisoners were supposed to be released from Rajeshah prison, but on the orders of the Ministry of Intelligence, new cases were filed against them to prevent their freedom on the charge of propaganda against the state. <laughs>